Okay, so it's Shannon here. Today is August the 31st, 2024. I am going to do a video really quickly. Um, and basically, the, the purpose of this video today is I'm in my office. And as you can see, if I don't get kicked out of here, I'm going to get into all the details about that. But if you can see here, I'm in my office. And so here are my products, again, set up here. All the products, most of the products that are on my website are over here. So anybody can, well, I guess can't do that today. But um, I was the purpose of meeting today is to have an appointment set up so people can stop by and see the products and preview training sessions or anything like that they wanted to do or ask any questions or make a donation to the business and all that and everything. And so um, I'm going to have to leave early today because there's a glitch with the system and schedule and all that and everything. That's fine. So, but I did want to make this video because I wanted to state that. Um, if you did decide to come once if you make an appointment to this office and I do decide to stay in this office, it might be better to take an alternative route because if you look up on the highway, I don't know if you can see it, but the traffic is like really bad. So that may be a problem. Oops, sorry. The traffic is like really, really bad out there. If you can see it, I don't know if you can see how bad it is, but it's like really so coming down I-45, it might be a little bit of a struggle to get to this particular office. So um that might be a problem. So I would suggest you make an alternative um alternative site to be able to get here but that's okay i might end up switching and going to another office or something like that i'll let my customers know um when they get on my website but i did want to say i'm in my office today and the business is still open and running and i do have fall sessions tutoring sessions signed up for the upcoming school year as well as all the products that i have and um that i've that are based upon research i can get into detail about them but i've done it already let me start but you can see all the products and everything like that that are based on the most effective strategies to use and then you guys have already seen these this is what i'm working on right now which is a lesson plan for um for this story monica's adventures and miss groups for, for kids and um this is a lesson plan that i've created that i'm working on right now you can see on figurative language that goes along with it you can see um figurative language a literal language it's raining cats and dogs <laughs> really cute um it's really raining really hard right there outside right now really cute little lesson plan I'm working on right now so I'm taking appointments and all that and everything and talking to people and all that and everything and so um what I wanted to say is I was going to add to my children's stories I've written which is Dream to Chain Sandville Miss that's one right there Miss Real School for Kids as well as um the Real Princess as well as um the other ones I wrote um they are based upon the most effective strategies to use because including and implementing real authentic literature experiences in addition to teaching isolated objectives is very, very effective as an effective teaching strategy. So I wrote in my curriculum lesson plans that, that align with the particular literature stories that I've written, many of them that I've written, there's others I've written as well. But I've lost them throughout the year, so I'm trying to find them and add to them and make them better and all that and everything. So that's why I'm updating that particular lesson plan because there's a more updated lesson plan with the PowerPoint presentation that I'm making than when you just saw to go along with the text Miss Real School for Kids which is on figurative language so you notice that I'm implementing the objectives that required to teach as elementary educators and I'm, I'm using authentic literary experience that I created myself in lessons that I've created myself to line all that together perfectly so that's what I'm working on right now with that so anyway so um yeah have a great day and I will um update everyone on whether I was in this office or not I'm not sure how that's going to work out it's kind of a little problem going on right now with that and um and then I will let people know what's going on and I will so just check my um, website daily to look that look into that and I hope everybody has a great day guys God is good, we're blessed, and it's a wonderful day, and I'm excited about what the future holds for me and all at once that um, decide to support the business and the products in the business. Have a wonderful day.